hello friends let's see how we make these pouches these folders that will hold the nomenclature card sets okay so i have taken uh, this yellow sheet of paper now we will uh, also categorize the colors so we will use yellow sheets for uh, arithmetic okay so uh, you will uh, you know this is your card paper a normal ordinary card paper you will use these and i have cut it out to you can see this is 30 35 centimeters okay so from here to here is 35 centimeters this way okay so this is 35 centimeters and this is 25 centimeters okay so the width is 25 and this is 35 now at at 5 centimeters from top 5 centimeters you can see 5 centimeters 5 centimeters you mark always mark in three places so that you have a good guideline and you draw this line at 5 centimeters same thing from here mark 5 centimeters and you draw this line so 5 5 you mark and you get this line these are at 5 so you have 5 and 5 that makes 10 so you are left with this square this portion here which is 15 centimeters okay so 5 15 and 5 that makes 25 along this side okay now let's go this way Again, you will mark 15 centimeters. So you can see this is 15 centimeters, 15 centimeters, and you have a band of 5 here. So mark 15, 15, 15, draw this line. Again, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, draw this line, and you have this band of 5 centimeters. Is this clear? Yeah, so this is how you will mark your paper. Okay, so what will you have? You will have these two squares of 15 centimeters. Now let us see how we fold this. So I have folded it here. So this will be your first fold. The one that we marked here on the 5 centimeters here. So what you will do is you will uh, preferably take a ruler. Better not to take a metal ruler here. Yeah? You can take a sorry. You can take a plastic ruler. So that you know it doesn't really cut the paper. Keep it like this and then give it a push like this. You know, give it a push so you get this first fold. This is your first fold. Then this will be your second fold. Give it a push. And give it a push. And then you make your second fold. Okay, don't make, don't uh, crease it too much or the paper might tear. We use good quality paper always so that it lasts you a long time. So now you have this first and second fold. This is already folded. Now we will make this third fold. So you will have this 15 centimeters here. So this will be your third fold. And this will be your fourth fold. So place your ruler here. This two are already, these two are flap, those two flaps are already folded. Okay, after that along with that you make this fold. And then you make this fold. So these are the four folds that you will make. And this is what your pouch will look like. So this pouch will hold these cards which are 14 centimeters. So they will fit in properly. Okay, They will fit in comfortably over here. So uh, and you can have about uh, 7 to 10 cards in this and you can have uh, the slips here. If, if for the third set, you will need these slips also. You close them like this and you keep your folders like this. Now, on top of this folder, in the center, you can write the name. Like uh, in your um, geometry cards, on top here, you will draw the, uh, for the first set, you will uh, so draw the base basic shape. You will draw a small triangle here. And you will write the basic shapes. All that I will give you in your nomenclature cards. What is to be written on top of the folder. And what is to be written inside the slips. All of that I will be giving you. And here on this. On this flap here. Over here. You will write. Say you have seven cards in here. You will write seven here. So you know that seven cards go in here. Okay. And on top here. On the right side. You can give this a reference number. You can call it a 1A. So you will write your Roman numeral 1 
and you will write a so you can assign these numbers as you like so say in your geometry you have got different folders so first is the basic shapes then you have triangles you have pentagons uh, you have polygons you have quadrilateral so all of that you will give numbers one two three like that you can give them numbers or you can call them money money one b one c as you feel comfortable so the and this uh, so you have written this right now on these slips that you have on these slips also on the reverse side on the on the reverse side you will write the number okay you will write the number here on the reverse side again you will write one a and you will put one so one a one and this same number will go on this card also so this will be your one a one so suppose this was your uh, square which you have written here say you've written square here then this square and this square will match so you have a picture of the square here which you will stick and that that and that will match so when the children are matching these two they will have uh, you know a reference number they will know uh, as a control of error that they have matched the correct ones so that is one more thing that you need to remember so these reference numbers are important okay write the same number numbers but here you will also write the uh, number of the card okay so that's it about the nomenclature cards